Oh. Well, five minutes into it, thing already <laughs> broke down. Didn't even make it back. Getting into the toe back and I guess the belt popped off or something. <laughs> <laughs> Skipped the buying part, picked up this fresh Ford Ranger for a solid 600 bucks. That thing's not too bad, not too bad. We'll bring it back, hopefully get a belt on it, mess around for the day. Should be a good time. Shot. Get a picture of me and my web. I'm getting it right now. Dude, what? Drives so straight. Drives good? Mint, and then it was started. It was just going. Pa -pa -ta 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 -ta. Hey, from when you Things fresh. Hey, from when you passed me to here, never let off the drop. Just hooked on or what? Hey, what do you think you're doing driving, buddy? You're gonna, they're gonna, you're gonna end up getting. You're right. I gotta, ass. I gotta vlog. You're right. No, you're right. Good man. Well, we'll get this thing uh, back to the shop, Joe. Jeez. <laughs> Now I gotta run. Oh. All right. Beautiful. He has to be riding the brakes. You're doing almost 50 pulling him right now. No, I'm not. Relax. I'm not <laughs> about an hour. Yeah, now because we're coming up to a stop sign. Oh. <laughs> I thought he just hit the. I thought he just hit me. Hey, it was already rolling. The brakes. Okay, stop on the brake now. No. Look at that. Look at that. The bike. You can't touch it until we hit something. See how they're doing back there? Solid. Solid. It's the last time you drive, Joe. Shut the fuck up. Betsy made it. What do we got back here? Some two freshies. Looks like that's the belt. Is it? <laughs> yeah. It was there the whole time. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Take a look at this baby. Let's see this thing. Oh my. 2.3 liter, 16 valve. Man, this thing is a gem. Interior shot. Oh, nice. Oh, thought I wasn't going to open there. This thing's actually pretty clean. To be honest, it's not too bad besides the rip seat. 625. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Couldn't haggle her down anymore. She wanted 800. I said five. She wasn't having it. So 625 it was. This thing's pretty fancy. Look, it's, it's <laughs> the whole body's coming off. All rusted. Man, this thing's actually got some fresh rubber too. We got sandbags in the back. Gonna be hooking up good. Bumper. Give a little weight. Stomp on it. All right, the next day, so Joe threw his old 6.0 battery in here. Thing runs like a champ now, doesn't die. That ratchet strapped down because I jumped it on the pit bike rollers and the battery flew out almost. So, let's test this thing out now. We got wires hanging now, it's a little sketchy. Anthony said that the throttle was sticking, so it's even better, even safer now. Where's the key? Somebody really took the key out of this thing, huh? Like somebody wants to steal this. It's definitely Joe. Oh, there it is. <laughs> there it is. Starts right up. Do I let her warm up? Nah. Sauce completely fell off now. Jump down this. Oh, jeez. in and I can film them. Thing runs like a dream though. Man. Ah, we'll leave the key in it. This thing is so much fun. I'm glad we bought this thing. <sighs> Been a 
a while since I've ridden this thing. Figured I'd take it out. Got to give it a wash, so I might as well get it dirty first. Take it on the pit bike track, mess around, and have some fun. All right, so I just got to the shop, got this thing out of the truck. You guys would have already seen um, some of the riding on my Instagram if you don't already follow me on why this rear tire is currently pretty much shredded. King on the rear tire, the front tire, still after two years of me owning it, is still the stock tire that came on it. This uh, Pirelli something tire, it's all super rounded or edged off from the road, but still working fine. I don't see a reason to change it out. Maybe, maybe I'll throw Ryan's old one on there just because they have matching Dunlops. Sounds like a lot of extra work to me. Who knows, we'll see how I'm feeling that day. Thing just destroys tires though. In the shop in here, Shout out to Ryan, he doesn't know yet. I'm taking his fresh used tire from his 250, which has got plenty of tread for me for the Alta. I never put new tires on the Alta, so this is pretty much a brand new tire for that thing, which will go on here shortly. We still got a couple more burnouts on this thing before we change that. But if you don't follow my Instagram, I would have played these clips in the actual video, not cropped, but since it was filmed upright, it would have cut the quality. I'll just play it as if you saw it on my Instagram. Wanna see what's going down before the videos come out, but let's go cruise around on this thing, test it out on the pit bike track. Oh, it's way too big from when I rode the 250 on it, but it's still fun. We're in uh, mode one. I'm sure a lot of people forgot I even had this thing or are new and have never actually seen the Alta. Guess giving you a little run over real quick. Here's my 2006. 17 Alta Redshift MX, not the MXR. Did a build on it like two years ago now. It's been a while and uh, it's due for a change up. Power coated a bunch of stuff, Cerakoted parts, and uh, this thing came out pretty sweet in the uh, in the end. Got a Honda front end on it, coated a bunch of stuff on it. So you can search on the channel, find the build series on this thing, but we'll cruise around, have a little fun, test this thing out. We're almost out of battery. Got probably an hour left if I keep it in mode one out of the four modes. If you're new to Altas, I'll probably throw it in two for uh, cruising around. One's like super mellow, two's like the perfect in between. This thing is so much fun. I forgot how fun this thing is. A little tight. I think it's gonna destroy the track. Oh. is so much fun. Wish the track was bigger. It's like a, what, 15 second lap time on this thing. I think it was like 25 seconds on the pit bikes.
torque, the instant torque on this thing is just insane. You've never ridden one of these and you get a chance to, you see somebody at the track with one, ask him to ride it and then you'll understand just how insane this thing is. And with a, a ball tire right now too, things just spinning. It's too, too much fun. I love this thing. I haven't ridden it in like six months. Been sitting in the garage. Try a couple slow wheelies on this thing. Fast wheelies are easy, but the slow ones to really ride it smooth or hard with the torque. I usually put it in mode one and then go really slow, balance, kind of compress the forks. Oh, and then just do a throttle. Try that again. There we go. Just being super smooth with the throttle, not like snapping it real quick. Doing them five minutes ago. Can't do them anymore. I could pretty much hit everything here in one. It's just the two gives you way more torque off the off the bottom than one. It's super mellow. Could bump it up to four. Do the same thing I did in my Instagram. Try and conserve a little battery, not run it in four the whole time. But Whoa. I guess we'll go cruise around on the road, do a couple fast wheelies, show you that. Before Ryan gets here and we start riding pit bikes. Also, if you guys are new and you want to see more videos with the Alta, let me know in the comments, like this video, subscribe if you're new. If you won't miss any future videos on this thing, pit bike racing, I think we're going to change the track up a little bit more here in the next week or so, take some stuff out, add some new stuff. So if you don't want to miss that, you'll see it here in the next few weeks. But let's go keep cruising around on this thing. I got to do Joe's suspension on his pit bike. He's been bothering me because he wants to ride today. I got to do his forks and shock. There we go, there we go, there we go. Oh, oh. Pretty good one. Kind of ran out of power there towards the end, too. Started at like 30 miles an hour, too. That's probably why. Thing is so much fun. Love this thing. Ugh. And we're off and nobody even knew I was riding. So with that, like I said, if you're new, subscribe. If you want to see more e-bike videos and pit bike videos, I'm um, coming over here. Like I was saying earlier, Joe hasn't even ridden his pit bike. He's ridden it like one time with me. He's got all the BBR springs and dampening rods I got to put in for him. So hopefully I can get that done in the next hour and he can get riding with us. And uh, should be a good time. Like I said, like the video, comment what else you want to see. With that, I'll see you guys in the next video.